two weeks since my last video. As you can see, we're back with another car tour. This is the BMW M235i Grand Coupe, and it's our brand new car. So we're going to be doing a review and a vlog for you of the new car. Um, it's becoming a bit like Talk of the Tom Top Gear on here lately, but I hope you enjoy this uh, new car tour that we put together. <music> Anyway, you might have seen driving outside there. Yeah. Didn't get it all in. time driving the new car funky colour with this car, it's the uh, Red Snapper Rock it's called. This car's a bit controversial uh, because it's a four cylinder and it's an uh, all wheel drive as well. So all of the BMW petrol heads are going mad over this car, but uh, I really like it. Um, so we've got the LED headlights again. And as you can see, there's a brand new grill on this car with a matte titanium surround which uh, matches the vents, the wheels and also the wind mirrors. Uh, so we're going to show you around the car now. As you can see we've got the matte titanium wheels here which do match the mirrors and on this car as well it's the M Sport badge. I'm going to show you the back of the car now. So it's a very similar design to the um, 7 Series Coupe uh, with the quite trendy futuristic lights on the back and there are real exhausts here as well. I'll show you the boot. So we've got our BMW umbrella here. Now my mother requested that the BMW garage gave us this free umbrella because uh, my mum likes her umbrellas. So we've got a 
first aid kit there. This floor does lift up so you can fit more items in there. It's a pretty decent sized boot to be honest. So as you can see we got the M Sport logo on the other side as well. And now we're going to show you the interior of this car. In the car. My dad chose this because he thinks he's um, Kylie Jenner, that's why. So um, we normally go for the oyster leather, but I'm a big fan of this red leather on the chairs. I think it works really well with the blue we've got outside, so I'm happy about it. So this is the view from the driver's side. As you can see, we've got a very a similar steering wheel to what we had on the other car and the uh, driver's display there. It has the heads up display there as well. So it's all nicely laid out and the screen is here pointing towards the driver. the uh, controls here now so this the automatic and uh, the control to use the screen very similar on the other BMW we had we also have a self-charging phone area here so you can pop your phone in there and it will charge automatically got the cup holders there and the center center armrest and console We've got the air conditioning and we went for the black hexagon trim. It goes all the way around the car as well. There is mood lighting here, which I'll show you now at night time. get your Apple CarPlay on the screen here um, as you can see it says welcome John it used to say welcome Monty Burns because someone put that on there <laughs> and yeah you put it on me and yeah for a car of uh, this size it's quite impressive However, it really does have everything you'd want for, for the driver's standpoint yeah so I'm in the back of the car and for me it's just about enough room I'm about six foot and uh, yeah, it's a pretty decent amount of leg room. It's got the pockets, the nice red on the doors, electric windows, the Harden and Calm and sound system as well. Because it's a coupe, it doesn't have um, the top. So there you are, it's got, you can put two coffees in here. And there we are, it's this BMW is sold and is awaiting its new owner's arrival, John. <laughs> It does have air conditioning for the passenger as well. Um, yeah. You can see the back of the chairs are in a black leather. Thank you everyone for watching this. Um, 
we're very pleased with this car for the size it really does have everything you could want and more um, we're very happy with it uh, I know a lot of people complain about it but um, I like it they like it everyone's happy here um, so that's it from me today we do have well three other car tours on this channel now and this will be the last one for a while because we can't keep buying cars for YouTube it costs a fortune so there are three other car tours on my channel I managed to say that without having a blooper this time and that's the 5 series which is the BMW we had before this one the Volkswagen Polo Beats and the Fiat 500S so I'll leave the links and everything in all the pop-ups here now I'm off to have a nice big glass of wine now as the weather is so nice and cold for today it's about 18 degrees I think so yeah, I'm going to enjoy the last of the sun. After all that, it's knacking me out doing these bloody videos, honestly. <laughs> so thanks everyone, and we'll see you in the next video. Cheers everyone, bye.